Hello everyone and welcome back, finally. I have my wheels and I have tires on them, finally. That's, that, that's what we've been waiting for so long. Finally we have tires on the wheels that we can put on. I'm, uh, oh Jesus, I'm, uh, I'm excited for it. Well, <laughs> anyways, welcome back to another video. Uh, that's uh, the first thing that we need to say. Hold on. So, uh, I know it's been a while, uh, last video we uploaded, I uh, didn't really do much, we were just installing the air suspension and uh, stuff like that. Uh, I have fixed the last part with the air suspension, I do though need to check for some leaks today, but I'm thinking that we're gonna put on the wheels today, see how it looks, test out the air suspension, um, just to see how it goes down and whatnot. Um, and I'll bring you guys up to speed a little, because I've been in the garage here for like the past uh, three uh, days uh, fixing a little and uh, taking some measurements and uh, stuff like that but uh, let's mount these and I'll bring you guys up to speed once we're done uh. let's see here. so hopefully if I've done all my adjustments correctly here in the rear we don't need spacers. Just need to get this on. Okay. Um, I've uh, adjusted some camber in the rear uh, just to make sure that uh, we get a okay fitment and uh, um, I don't need spacers. Uh, I did this like just a couple of days ago before I got the tires on so I still need to check some uh, like clearance with the, the tires uh, now that they're on uh, because I do have a feeling that they could be a little bit pain in the ass like here um, but uh, we'll see we'll see uh, but in the last couple of days that I've been here uh, I've painted the brake calipers and I fixed some adjustments on the air, uh, air suspension and then also uh, I noticed that I had some leaks so that's what we're kind of doing today we are putting on the wheels and then we are checking for some leaks because that's not good but just to show you guys how it turns out I've, I've already done this with uh, uh, without the wheels on but uh, or the wheels but without the tires on but we're gonna try to just lower everything uh, now one one time I mean god <laughs> it is tucking pretty okay up front uh, as I said we could use a spacer but uh, other than that it looks really good but look at this rear I mean oh. <laughs> fucking hell the wheel is just the wheel is just up there it's just <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay so I, I I really get it now this is what uh, this is what it feels like when you finally get done with something it's uh, looking at this um I'm really happy I mean I mean look Look, look at that. Jesus Christ, it looks great. But it doesn't, I, I, I mean, I, we probably made a mistake here because I shouldn't have lowered it before I measured everywhere, but fuck me. And it doesn't really hit, it doesn't really, I mean, it does hit here a little um, on this part here. Uh, on the side spat, I could probably, I uh, could probably cut, uh, cut that down a little because that's not really good. But it it tucks, it tucks really good. I'm uh, I'm impressed. I'm impressed, really. <sighs> I mean. Damn. All right, but let's air up the car, uh, fill fill it to like a uh, hundred or something psi, 
and check for leaks a little because I'm a little bit worried that it's leaking somewhere so we're gonna have to check that out uh, just let's just uh, raise it a little so we're gonna stop at these values right here it's around a hundred um, and that should be able to just uh, uh, make us look for any leaks. So uh, let's just wait for the air tank to fill up. I got some uh, soapy water with me so we can check all the connections here and there. Uh, so that's that's good. But uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm really happy about these results. I mean, damn. <sighs> all right, so um, some bad news. Um, I was just... Um, testing out the um, I was just looking for the leaks uh, found the two leaks and it was in the connections to uh, the air management system so uh, probably we just need to change uh, the connections and uh, use some better Loctite or Loctite uh, um, yeah to uh, make sure that it doesn't leak but a new problem that just occurred is that uh, the two uh, uh, the two front uh, bags in the control menu it shows that I have the maximum pressure on them but uh, they are empty so uh, it seems that uh, the pressure uh, valves or something in the air management system has uh, died or something because I'm, I'm getting uh, I'm getting maximum values even though the air suspension is uh, in the bottom, so uh, that that didn't really lighten the mood. Um, fucking shit, to be honest. We will see. We will see tomorrow. Hopefully, I get answers. So I'll check back with you tomorrow, I guess. I'm going home. Um, it's not always that fun to be in the garage. All right, but uh, I'll get back to you. <laughs> One eternity later. All right, so uh, finally uh, we do have an update on uh, the air suspension that uh, we've been waiting for. I mean, Jesus Christ, for you guys it's just been a second or something, but uh, I haven't explained everything because I've just been waiting for it to come back, uh, literally. Uh, the thing was that um, we got the wrong values uh, on the air pressure uh, sensors in the front bags so uh, when we had the bags totally empty uh, the the controller still showed that the bags were completely filled like to the max uh, I reached out to uh, uh, where I bought it from uh, they told me to send some pictures I sent some pictures and they were just like, yeah, okay, we understand, um, we'll replace it, we're, we will be sending a new one, just uh, please send back this, uh, the one that you have now. Um, so I sent back uh, that one and they sent the new one. And uh, this was... This was three weeks ago, something like that. Three and a half weeks ago, maybe even. So I'm just sitting, waiting for it to uh, arrive, and then we're going straight back out to the garage so we can just do this last shit to get the car out. <sighs> yeah, it's uh, horrible to uh, buy overnight parts from Japan. It's not, it's not overnight parts at all. It's like uh, over fucking a month parts from Japan. Yeah. Great, I'll update you guys in just a little bit when we have the air management system again. All right, so um, the package just came. Um, I was going to like the UPS uh, pickup point and uh, because it didn't show that it had arrived yet and I went to the UPS pickup point and uh, it actually, uh, <laughs> I actually saw the UPS truck standing there and I was just like, okay, but uh, did you deliver any packages here? And he, he was just like, yeah, I just got one. And I was like, okay, hope it's mine, hope it's mine. And uh, it was. So uh, that's great. Um, also went and bought some Loctite for uh, the um, 
the adapters that go into the air management system for the air hose. So uh, yeah, just sitting in waiting in traffic right now so we can go out to uh, Rotna uh, to the garage. But uh, yeah, that's great news. So uh, now we can finally install it and uh, actually get the car out of the garage. Maybe not today though, but we'll definitely just drive it out and uh, see how it looks when it's outside of the garage because it, it has not seen like uh, the daylight in, uh, I don't know, or is it month? Uh, it's month uh, June now almost. So it hasn't seen the daylight in like, what, six? seven eight eight nine months <laughs> okay that's crazy but uh, yeah all right <laughs> to the garage uh, so um, the air management system is inside of the car right now and uh, I just uh, put in the hose real quick to see uh, for any leaks and stuff like that just make sure that it works and uh, well it uh, It does work, uh, but we do have uh, some of my like adapters that the hose go into the air management system. They are leaking. Uh, actually, three of them are leaking, like uh, the inside of the air management system or the adapter. So I would probably need to get myself like uh, a couple new ones because these are apparently not apparently not working so well. Um, hold on. They're not working so well, so we're gonna have to fix that. But uh, I mean, at least it works, and the car is looking pretty slick. But uh, yeah, uh, it's Friday today, so I don't know when I will be able to get some new adapters. Maybe on Monday or something. Ah, uh, project. I don't know the English version for it, but it's a long time project. It just keeps rolling on. <laughs> uh, oh well, but uh, see you guys on Monday. Oh, come on. <sighs> there you go. And um, we're back for the last day, hopefully, uh, with this project right now at, at least. Um, we had the issues that uh, the fittings or adapters for the air hose were leaking and not holding air due to that we had these like quick release adapters for it uh, I have changed them right now and uh, hopefully that will work uh, it looks like they are uh, uh, holding the air so it's not leaking anymore so that's good uh, but I'm thinking that we're gonna test it out a little and uh, see if we can get the car out from the garage now because It's bright outside and the sun is out, so we uh, we want to test it out. I did um, just wipe down the car a little, um, so it's a little bit looks a little bit fresher right now. Oh shit! Uh, but uh, I mean, the car is sitting good. I mean, but. Uh, Let's uh, start it up and start the air suspension and uh, see how it works. And uh, it works. The air suspension is, uh, or the air hose, is uh, not leaking any more air, and uh, the car looks amazingly fresh.
I'm uh, really happy with the result uh, of it. I mean, uh, I think it looks amazingly good, uh, but uh, I think that's almost everything. We just have maybe have some other things to do, but not for this summer. <laughs> but uh, damn, we. Uh, My steering wheel is a bit loose, so I need to check up why. Why is that? <laughs> it's uh, a little. Uh... Yeah. <laughs> it's the bolt in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're gonna need to check that out before I drive the car. But uh, other than that. Uh... Yeah, now we're going to eat because I'm hungry. Yeah, we're going to eat. Uh, but that will be it for today. Um, it was just like some short testing with the car and uh, I'm just uh, really happy to finally have it done. Um, I'm thinking like maybe next weekend uh, we'll go to just a local car meet and we can take out the car. Uh, it's currently raining outside so I'm not really that stoked about driving out the car. And I did just put some uh, uh, like paint protection on uh, the wheels so we're not taking out the car today so sorry for that but uh, I'll see you guys uh, in the next video instead when we can take out the car see how it drives also I mean that's like the biggest thing <laughs> but uh, at least it's looking good in the garage sitting here I like when it's rain when it Okay, but thanks for watching guys and girls and uh, hold on, come on and uh, make sure to su uh, make sure to subscribe if you haven't and I'll see you guys in the next video hopefully next weekend already.